Hey, what's up, everyone? Sharpshooter24 here. And today, I've been uh, messing around with some advanced map and some uh, Pokemon hacking tools. So, today in advanced map, I took Pokemon Ruby because it's a very stable ROM to hack. And I've been going in and I've been messing around with the color changes. So, that's what all of these are for. Like, it's called tile sets, and basically, Let's say I wanted a rock here. I just take all the tile sets and make a big rock, but I don't want to. So, i am just been messing around with some of this, and I know some people that have trouble with advanced map. So I'm going to show you how to insert one type of tile into the game, so you can change those around. So, I would go to Route 111, because it has grass, sand, and rocks. So you're going to click this right here, it's called the block editor. Then you go picture, well first you want to scroll down until you see the rocks. Then you're going to left click on it and it's going to pop up here. So you're going to right click on that rock and it's going to bring you to a palette. So now you're going to press picture, save tile set 1 and save it on a place where you can find it. I just call it mountain because that's what it reminds me of. So then you're going to right click on it. Press open with paint. And you need some experience of color changing, or this is going to be very difficult for you. There's a little blue dot right here, and you want to click and drag that over so you have some more space. You're going to need a different rock, like a different color mountain, and this is a bunch of tile sets. So then you're going to copy it and paste it onto here. So then you're going to highlight, select this whole normal rock, and just move it over here. So now what you're going to do is, you're going to do the color swap method on all of these colors to these colors. So you want this to end up looking like this when you're done. So I have no video editing software, so you're going to have to bear with me. And just go in and swap all the colores. Oh, big mistake there. So I've been doing this for quite some time. And I have some hacking experience. I just don't know how to make scripts and stuff. Like, I would make a complete hack, but I really don't have time for that. I'm in school, and I'm on my school's track and field team. So I'm very tight on time most of most of the week. So when I'm bored, I sometimes just come in here and make hacks for myself to play. Just because I, I get bored sometimes. So almost done color swapping here. Just give me like another minute or so, I'll be done. And I, I'm sorry I haven't uploaded any videos recently, but again, really squeezing in time to make these. Oh yeah, this is what I usually do for this kind of rock. I'll go back up to here. Okay, so last two things. And if you do know how to color swap already, and when you save it, you might get an error saying something like, the ROM cannot read the colors as such, or something similar to that. That pretty much means you are using colors in this palette that are different than everything else. So the game says, Oh, I don't know how to read this. And generally, that's because of this gray outline. So you want to make sure you even swap that. So, now that we have our completely recolored mountainous terrain, you want to click on the eraser and make sure it's the biggest size. And then you're just going to get rid of this one. And make sure you stay within the black boundaries that are already given to you. So, when you're done doing this, what you want to do is you want to get your old rock, well, your new rock, and drag it within the boundaries of that black square. And then, just drag it back into the white square that you made earlier. Now make sure you get this blue dot and drag it back 
right to the edge. And then hit File, Save. So you can close this now. So now you want to go to your advanced map, and you're going to click the block editor again. And this time you're going to click Picture, Load Tile Set 1, and you're going to click your Mountain Tiles. So you're going to click OK, and it's going to change here. Now, in some circumstances, this may not work, so if it does or doesn't, this is for explanational purposes. So you want to click Picture and Load New Blocks. It's taking a while because Cam Studio is making this lag. And then it changes all these. So you'll notice there's a slight bug here, and I usually get that with this kind of rock. So let's say you do something, and you don't like it, and you just don't like the way it works. You just want to go in you want to find a different style of rock or a different tile so I keep a folder with a bunch so you're gonna just open that up whoops this is the wrong one and go to that new tile so this is all the time I have for this video because it takes my computer takes an hour to upload videos like literally so Thanks for watching, and uh, part two will be coming up really soon. So, uh, this video wasn't probably the best, but the next one will show you how to replace these rocks for the crappy rocks that we don't like here. So, okay, thank you, and uh, please like and favorite the video if you want to. Can't force you. So, uh, thanks.